Good morning, everyone. It's great to see you again. I hope you've been practicing your match grip. Can everyone show me your match grip? So we're gonna take our hands, put them a third of the way down the stick, wrap the other fingers around, make sure you check that there's a nice little hole in there. Great, that's our match grip. And then make sure that your drum pad is at the right height for you, just like we did last week. Okay, so today we're going to learn a new stroke. It's called a flam. And I'm gonna put up a picture of a flam so you can see it. Now, if you play piano or another instrument, this might look like a grace note to you. And actually, a flam and a grace note are the same thing. But since we're percussionists, we're cool, so we call it a flam instead of a grace note. So here's what it's gonna sound like when you play a flam. First, I'll just play you four of our regular trampoline strokes. Ready? So those are our trampoline strokes. Now remember how in the picture there was that little note right in front of the bigger note? Now we're gonna add it. Instead of sounding like bup, bup, it's gonna sound like but up, but up. Just a little tiny note beforehand and then our main note. So ready, I'm gonna play four flam strokes now. Did you hear how many hits were in each one of those? Yeah, two, the little one to start and then the big one after. So now we're gonna practice it, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna start playing both at the same time. So both of your sticks should be hitting the drum at the same time. I wanna see who can hit both of their sticks at the same time every time. Um, both hitting at the exact same time, okay? Ready, go. Looks good. Okay, everyone stop. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start like that, but then we're going to gradually start hitting your non-dominant hand just a little bit before your dominant hand. Remember that your non-dominant hand is the hand that you don't write with. So raise your hand that you write with in the air. Yeah, that's your dominant hand. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with hitting both at the same time, and then when I say switch, we're gonna start hitting our left hand just, or non-dominant hand, just a bit ahead of our dominant hand. So it's gonna, in slow motion, the flam stroke is gonna sound like this. It's gonna look like this. Do you see which one of my hands is hitting stronger? Yeah, it's my dominant hand, so the second should be stronger. It shouldn't sound like this. Which one's stronger then? Yeah, they're both equal. So what we want is for the first one to be a little weak and tiny, and then the second one much stronger. Okay, everyone try it. We're gonna start with our hitting both sticks at the same time, and then when I say switch, we're gonna start hitting our non-dominant hand just a little bit before. Okay, ready, go. Both at the same time. Make sure your hands are relaxed. Okay, ready, switch. Make your dominant hand stronger than your non-dominant hand. Okay, everyone stop. So here's what you should be practicing at home. Here's what you should do, just what we just did. And your flam stroke should sound like this once you're done. See how my non-dominant hand hits first, then my dominant hand much stronger, and the strokes are very close together, not like this. Okay, great work everyone. Keep practicing your flams.